Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from mysocialview.com and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, we're going to talk about how to exclude people from your Facebook ad campaigns. And now, you can exclude people based on their location or based on different interests that they have. Before we jump into the video, you know what to do, right? Subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. All right, now let's jump into this. So sometimes we run into this situation recently. We were targeting a specific city and just for example, I'm going to use the example of Addison. So we were targeting a specific city uh, on Facebook ads and it was like plus and 10 mile radius. Now sometimes when you have the plus 10 mile radius, what happens is you also get into another city. So if you look at Carrollton, uh, it's pretty close, right? So a lot of cities in the United States, depending on where you live, obviously, cities are like very, very close by. So if you have a city A plus 10 mile radius in your targeting, that might show you add to people who are living in another city. So for example, in this case, if I'm, I have Addison plus 10 mile radius, I may see uh, show my ad to people who, are, who live in Carrollton or uh, vice versa. If I'm targeting Carrollton plus 10 mile radius, I might capture some audiences and or show my ads to people who live in Addison. So sometimes that's okay, but sometimes it's not. Uh, maybe you know your local business and you only work in a specific city, you do not want to show your ads to people who live in a neighboring city. So how do you exclude people who live in a different city? So that's what we're going to see in today's uh, example. So I am going to go jump into my ads manager, which is right here. I'm already signed in. So I'm going to create a test campaign and I'll show you how to include and also exclude people from your ad campaign. So let's start over. And uh, our step number one is the campaign objective. Let's select uh, traffic as an objective. And I'm just going to say test campaign for the purpose of this demo, continue. And now all of the targeting for our Facebook ad campaigns, we do at the ad set level. So always remember that. The objective is selected at the campaign level. Targeting is selected at the ad set level, and then the actual ad, the image, the copy, the video is built at the ad level. So there are three levels of Facebook ads. Now, when you look at the ad set, so let's scroll down, and I'm not going to build out the whole campaign in this video. I want to focus on how to include and especially exclude different areas, different cities. So if you scroll down in the ad set at the audience uh, section, so this is where we can add the location. So let me add the example we add it in Texas. So by default, it selects. So let me zoom in and see how 25 mile is big. Look at that. Actually, this is another good example. So maybe, so if you look at this, if I have Addison plus 25 mile radius, let me make it big for you guys. Actually, let me change it to 10 mile radius and let's see. So default is 10 mile, uh, 25 miles, but you can uh, decrease it down to the minimum is 10 miles. But see what happens right here. So I have Addison 10 miles selected, but it's also showing my, ad, showing my ads to people who live in Carrollton, Richardson, University Park, and like some other area. So maybe I don't want to show my ads to people who live in Carrollton. It's very easy to exclude those. So to exclude people who live in Carrollton, what I'm going to do is click on this button right here, the include, and now select exclude. And now, let's do that. And I want to, I can do 10 miles, or I can also just exclude people who live in that city, current city only. So in that case, it's going to exclude people who live in Carrollton only. It's not going to, not by any radius. So in this uh, targeting that I have selected, my ads are being shown to people who live in Addison plus 10 mile radius, but people who live in Carrollton, Texas, they're excluded from my campaign. So this is a way to, it's kind of like a hidden setting. Uh, you can include different locations, different zip code, different cities, and then you can also exclude different locations and cities right here. And I've seen that again and again for local businesses. Sometimes a business, uh, it offers services or products to a specific city, but not like a neighboring city. So this is how you can exclude that. Now, I want to give another example. Let's uh, get rid of this, and I want to you can also exclude based on 
Let's go back to United States. There we go. You can also exclude. This would be, the first example was excluding based on the location. Now, let's look at the excluding based on different interests. So, let's say I'm creating a campaign and I want to target people who are interested in social media marketing. But I want to speak to people who are not, let's say, you know, the lawyers or people who are in the financial industry. Let's take an example of lawyers. So, maybe I'm creating a Facebook ad campaign targeting people who are... Uh, interested in social media marketing. So I'll go inside detail targeting and I'm going to put, so I want to target people who are interested in social media marketing, right? So let's look at this. So 23 million people. Let's actually, for the sake of our example, I'm going to uh, target my city, which is Dallas, Texas. There you go. 25 mile ready, that's fine. So now I'm targeting people uh, who are interested in social media marketing, so that's 480,000 people, great. But what if I don't wanna target people who are, let's say, lawyers? For some reason, you know, I wanna, uh, I don't wanna, my services or my product is not really for them, so I wanna exclude them for my, from my campaign. So what I can do is right here, there is exclude people. So I can click on that, and then I'll just type the word lawyer, Oh, there we go. So I can select that, and then there are other options. I can also select corporate lawyer. This is just an example. And you see right here, my potential reach decreased, I believe it was 480,000 to 400,000. So this is another way to exclude people from your campaign. So in this example right here, I am targeting people who are interested in social media marketing, but who are not uh, corporate lawyers or lawyers in general. So maybe my campaign, I don't, do not want to focus on them. So excluding people from your campaign can be very uh, powerful, especially for local businesses or even for your campaigns if you're targeting for online businesses or uh, global businesses. Because this, this helps you really exclude people and not waste your ad money or advertising dollars on people who are not really uh, proper or the right audience for your campaigns. Now, if you have any questions regarding how to include or exclude people in your Facebook ads, leave those questions in the comments below. And also, before you go, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell icon, like this video, and I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye for now.